Well, hello, my fellow Ravens. This is Abba Keel, and welcome to another video of RPG Maker MZ tutorials. For this tutorial, we're going to learn about plugins, how to emulate them into the game. For the first set of plugins, there's a way how it works. Works, and that is with these alt menu or save button picture text and text picture the rest is in my school by a website i'll put a link to the description below to the website for these other plugins this is the all free free from the website and that's sort of and that's actually pretty much it the rest of them cost money in and then for the best you work them out. So yeah. Start with the all menu screen. I'm gonna put them all in. And I go. So we save this to here. Go ahead and play it. Oh yeah, this is what it looks like in a different way. There you go. Oh, and I think the save, yeah, the save screen is actually different too. So there you go. Oh, and then you get allowed, you get actually allowed to turn them off. And then they look, and then the place actually looks different. See, there you go. And there you go too. Ooh. So it's up to you if you want to actually turn them off or not. So it's a thing. So yeah. Now this one now this plugin is just a ancient way of it. To do it, you just do a line over and over again, and then you put dot js. Yes, that's the name of the save file. I'll, and it, and it makes this file a plugin, which is actually like which is actually like a barcode to to, to put other to sort out other bar, other plugins too. Like I put the VS MZ zero on a call, and then I will put the battle call right here. Too. Like like I would add all the coal to this to this breaker, uh, and then and then put another breaker and so forth. But yeah. But anyway, that's what the slash bar of that what the slashes does for the JS file plugin does. It's like a breaker sorting out other plugins through uh. The rare, the rare other websites, definitely. Anyway, let me put the event in. In element item. The menu message uh, options is a lot. See on fly and how it works based on these plugins. And it's definitely on the website actually. The core engine is like everything based on it. I would say. A get rid of the console, put this on not true. Yeah, put this false. Everything else is actually it's actually pretty good. Yeah, everything else is actually pretty good. 
So just focus on those, turn off the console, go from here, make a pause, and then that's actually all pretty well. This is all well based on based on the battle. Though, uh, and all of these are actually pretty good too. Two, and then we'll actually make the game a lot better. See, there you go. So if I actually move my Keto, it will uh, motion diagonally the other way. See, and then, and then the menu options is actually kind of different. Showing icons of it. Get the option button over here. You can actually auto save or not. Your choice. This is different to based on style and and battle too. So it could be also when the screen or full screen. Save buttons like that. End game to the title. Format is through here. Quit. And then I show you the status. Actually, actually clear. All use. All option. Item. Different types of items. Okay. And that's actually pretty much it. I gotta say. So yeah, and then also time gold. So there you go. Yeah. That's the way how it works based on plugins in ESO. And that's actually pretty much it. I will show I will show more of them, but they're kinda hard to get to. Like I believe it costs like money to get them. So, so they're not free. They're actually kinda payable to get. Like if I go to make a thing, go to the website and choose our control. Let's go to hold on, I'm just I'm some some from the website actually. Extra status. There you go. Oh, and that's everything to the link. And I'm now able to actually download it. Okay. So yeah, it's actually relevant and actually kind of cool how it works based on based on its status. So um yeah, that's actually the the way how plugins work into a game for for RPG Maker MC. See, and I'm actually going to leave the video here. Here, because I now you know how it works. The energy core, battle core, event, movement core, element status core, items, clips core. All these are cores. So actually, and don't forget the divider. The plugin is all about dot. It's all about slashes, and they put dot js that will turn that into a plugin. All right. Anyway, with that, it's, I'm going to leave it here, and thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.